What's up, monkeys? My name's Shane, and you're watching The Lever Monkey. All right, so the video I'm working on today is inspecting our buckets making sure everything's looking good make sure all your pins your teeth you haven't rubbed through to your shanks because we're digging in rock so good places that you need to be inspecting your welds around your shanks edges of your buckets here make sure there's no cracks you can see this one's been built up a little bit more than this one over here you can see how they wear and another place you want to check check your welds welds on your ears make sure those are all good and I know we have a problem with this bucket back here we've got a crack developing right here and a matching one on the other side the weld is cracked right here now this is kind of an odd place for this uh crack to appear because normally you're when you're digging you're digging forces going forward and the pressure of your ears is pushing down right here so what usually causes the cracks on the back of your bucket would be from reaching out and shaking mud or just putting it out and banging it when you throw your material out to your spoils pile. So opening it up all the way. And the weight of the bucket is coming down, pulling away from those ears. And this is a heavy duty bucket we've got. This one's more designed towards um, rock digging, much thicker stock all our welds are good we did have to repair this up here this plate had come off you see we get wear on here which causes the slop back and forth in your buckets welds all look good be careful when you're checking these because you'll have a lot of burrs and stuff right here you can cut yourself on well everything looks good pins are safe so inspecting equipment is pretty important even your buckets I mean you do your daily walk around your machine check make sure things good just recently we just replaced this carrier roller because it was uh it sprung a leak on oil and whatnot so still in the rock still playing with the ripper just keep in mind guys you gotta keep track of all your stuff when you get off the machine to go to the bathroom or whatever or in the mornings check everything i mean check your pins make sure all your bolts are good nothing's broken off check welds uh quick connect is a big one so you can see just above where the quick connect is grabbing onto the pins the cross pins where it reduces in right along that area on this side that's where you typically will get a crack develop it'll crack right in the, those areas uh, this is a solid cast uh, quick connect so it's much stronger than some of the old ones that i've run before and the older ones the older styles they welded plates side by side to get that reduction and those welds would break all the time so all right guys i hope this helps you out a little bit gives you some information to um, inspect your machines it's there's all kinds of things that can come loose on these things i mean especially when you're digging in rock they're shaking and vibrating just make sure you do a good, good walk around all right guys we'll catch you later on the next one i'm out it's lunchtime